Hi, I'm Cassia Brooks, and the following material was written by me alone, well, and Emily, and re represents my own personal opinions on this, this topic. And I'm Emily Maloney, and the following material was written by me and Cassia alone, and represents our own personal opinions on this topic. You always see it in the sidebar of the other social networking sites you use. They're the ads with the funny pictures from the 80s with the huge hair and glasses. Classmates.com is a social networking site that allows you to connect with people you graduated with from elementary school, middle school, high school, or college. With a free membership, you can look up classmates, join your school communities, and create a profile. On your profile, you can share information about yourself such as who you're married to, stories about your kids, your hobbies, and even your career. Community albums allow users to upload pictures from the old days for everyone to see and comment on. Your free membership comes complete with a message inbox for getting in touch with your old math tutor, that kid you sat next to in English, or even that old flame. Classmates.com also offers a gold membership for $2.46 a month. With this upgrade, you can contact friends, see names on Classmate Maps, and see who has visited your profile. At first glance, Classmates.com seems like the perfect way to reconnect with old friends. After spending some time on the site and even registering for a free membership, the site seems deserted. No one posts pictures and very few people are registered for each school. Some cities in Alabama didn't even have schools listed on the site. I have yet to see someone post a picture or any conversations begin on the community pages. The interface itself is clunky but user and not and anything but user friendly. The home page that one is directed to is very bare and not sophisticated at all. So users are likely to assume the site is immature. Once the user picks their school and registers for an account, they are directed to a more polished site. This is a huge detriment to their site because the first page the user sees is, looks unreliable. The home page of a website is the first thing users look at. The home page must engage the users enough to navigate through the site and stay on the site. As a social networking site, it is important to gain the user's trust into signing up. Facebook is very reliable and socially acceptable, which is the reason why it is one of the most popular social networking sites. Usability is also a huge factor in the website's popularity and overall worth. The minute the user has to do more work to navigate through the site, the more likely they will leave it. Classmates.com does not have a very structural site and it lacks a navigation bar on the first homepage that you look to and a strong header. The fact that a user cannot see what other pages, where other pages are on the website means they will have a hard time finding them. The more confused and frustrated a user gets, the less likely they will spend time on the website. Overall, the concept for Classmates.com is great, but the output is not the best. A centralized place that makes it possible to locate and reconnect with old friends instantly is a well-planned, thoroughly thought-out idea. However, no one will use it if they feel it is untrustworthy. A design update may increase the validity of the site to its users, but as for now, it just seems a bit sketchy, for lack of a better word.